for the rest of her life. The origination of this glorious tale has been in and out of debate for centuries. The earliest literary references to Arthur came from the Welsh and Breton sources. Some speculate that the character of King Arthur is actually a pre galfridian tradition rather than a changeable story or text. One of the most famous Welsh poetic references to Arthur comes in the form of the heroic death songs known as Ye Godanin, supposedly written by the 6th century poet named Anirian. Another man by the name of Taliesin, a poet who lived in the 6th century, also refers to Arthur, although these are all probably date from the 8th century and 12th centuries. Finally, Arthur is mentioned numerous times in the Welsh Triads, a collection of short summaries of the Welsh tradition. In these summaries, it can be noted that the court begins to embody the legendary for the rest of her life. The origination of this glorious tale has been in and out of debate for centuries. The earliest literary references to Arthur came from the Welsh and Breton sources. Some speculate that the character of King Arthur is actually a pre galfridian tradition rather than a changeable story or text. One of the most famous Welsh poetic references to Arthur comes in the form of the heroic death songs known as Ye Godanin, supposedly written by the 6th century poet named Anirian. Another man by the name of Taliesin, a poet who lived in the 6th century, also refers to Arthur although these are all probably date from the 8th century and 12th centuries. Finally, Arthur is mentioned numerous times in the Welsh Triads, a collection of short summaries of the Welsh tradition. In these summaries, it can be noted that the court begins to embody the legendary 